Let me put you on a spot. Um, talking about election, election petitions, we know Nigeria has gone through, Ghana has also gone through, Kenya recently went through. And it appears uh, it has never happened that the election has been overturned. Why do you think so? If, yeah. Even if the court finds so that um, there are credible grounds that the election should be overturned. Well, if a court should rule that an election to be, is to be overturned, I don't think uh, it should be done you know, otherwise. In Ghana, for example, each time that we have sent petitions to the courts, we have always stuck to the ruling of the courts. I don't think it would be advisable for us, for example, to ignore what the courts will say. If we ignore what the courts will say, then it means we're trying to disobey the courts that we set up ourselves. And that will not go well for the peace of this country. So if we send a petition and the court rules that this is the verdict, I think we all have to obey. Maybe in other countries that you have cited, it's because the court feels that maybe they were right in the decisions they took. If it comes otherwise, then of course, maybe uh, those who sent it there didn't have the right, uh, what is it, presentation, or maybe they didn't argue their cases well. But I believe that once you take it to what it is, the Supreme Court or the High Court, and the High Court rules that this is the decision, everybody has to obey it. Everybody has to abide by it. So 